Hi everyone and welcome to the second part of the beautiful Colola. I'm Alex Beldi and today I will share with you this first full day at this very interesting place. During this day I witnessed some amazing sea turtle tracks that in my opinion are truly works of art. An olive ridley sea turtle mother laying down her eggs on the beach, sea turtles mating in the ocean, hatchlings making their way to the ocean and much more. So I truly believe that you will enjoy this episode of the Mexican Treasures. Let's go! I've dedicated years traveling to some incredible places. I'm Alex Beldi and I'm a wildlife photographer. Beauty and Art Project, it is a tribute to the planet, where I hope, through photography, to convey the beauty of the species and the place they have in the world, and try to help protect them, but also show the impact we have on them and their habitat. Support the project by choosing a membership on Patreon. If you are new on this channel and you would like to stay updated, please consider to subscribe. Thank you very much. I would like to start with a huge thank you to the people that are part of Beauty and Art family on Patreon. Thanks a lot guys and I'm very grateful for that. If you'd like to know more details about Beauty and Art family, please check the link in the description below. Morning guys, so it's early morning here in Kolola. I arrived uh, last night with the bus and now I uh, would like to go and check out the beach. This place is known because the uh, black turtles. Okay, let's pause here for a sec. Black sea turtles are unique members of the sea turtle world. While currently classified as the same species as the green sea turtle, the Pacific black sea turtle has several features that make it one of a kind. So please stay tuned for these episodes of Mexican Treasures and let's learn more about them. I haven't documented the black turtle yet, so it will be the first time. I hope to see it. Let's go and check it out. That's the nursery. There are the nests. Let's go closer. Let me show you around a little bit. The sun is rising over the mountain. The nursery is the place where the sea turtle legs are taken to safety, far from poachers and some predators. This is the open Pacific Ocean. It's so beautiful, so powerful, and big waves. Okay, so there are a lot of uh, sea turtle tracks here. Let me show you. These two right here were created by two black sea turtle mothers. As you can imagine, each sea turtle species lives behind a different and unique track. They are so beautiful. They are like a uh, work of art, but she's simply wa wa walking. <laughs> You can see any wildlife around here. Let's go. Wildlife is actually everywhere. If you look carefully enough, you'll see around the beach little crabs uh, and life is everywhere. You just have to pay attention and see it. But let's see if you can see any turtles on the beach. Oh, did you see? 
that was a beautiful thing done. There are sea turtle tracks pretty much everywhere. And uh, now I'm looking, there are four, I think there are black sea turtles. And it's the first time seeing them actually. I wish I could be closer. I wish I could be in the water with them. You can see the head that pops up. They submerge themselves in the ocean. You can see a little bit, a little bit the bottom part, but mostly the head when they come for uh, for air. There is a turtle going to the beach now to lay down their eggs. <laughs> As a wildlife photographer, I don't want to interfere negatively with this species. So when she's so relaxed that almost falls asleep, it makes me think that she is not considering me a threat. At this point, she is creating the nest. She digs the hole and with amazing skills, she is creating it with the shape of a pitcher. That way the eggs will be in a perfect environment to incubate and eventually this shape facilitates the way out of the hatchlings when they are ready. They are so intelligent. In the background, the powerful ocean continues to do his course and the mother turtle is very focused on her duty. They lay their eggs one to three times a season each time approximately 100 eggs. When she finished laying down the eggs, she covers the nest with the sand in order to keep a safe environment for her babies and of course to protect them from predators. This can be a very tiring job, so as you can see, she is putting a lot of effort into that. They are very good mothers. Here, she is not sad and she is not crying. Her body is simply shedding excess salt as well as protecting her eyes from the sand while she is nesting. Sea turtles live in salty ocean water their entire life and their bodies have adapted to survive without any fresh water. Here she is almost at the end of the nesting process. Now she is throwing sand to camouflage the nest with its surroundings. That way, it 
will be more challenging for some predators to find it. You see, she knows all that. And remember that they have been on the planet for over 100 million years before us. Everything they do have a purpose. But us? She must be very tired at this point, but she still continues with amazing strength. Here, she is throwing the last flippers full of sand and then she will make her way back to the ocean. Guardate cosa li liberiamo, guarda. If you are new on this channel and you would like to stay updated, please consider to subscribe. Thank you very much.